Hello and welcome back to my channel. This is Caitlin from Caitlin Plans and today I'm doing part two of my mega small shop haul for like May, end of May. I think these are mostly May releases so we'll call it that but I have five more orders to unbox with you today. I'm still waiting on one more in the mail. Well it said it was delivered and it hasn't shown up so I have to like probably contact someone about a missing order from Joann's but five orders here for me to unbox with you today. Um, one of them I kind of already took out of the packaging, which would be this Lovecraft's planner. Um, we've got Red Lyrics, which does sticker dolls, Gold Mine and Coco, which is another sticker dolls, uh, Create with Mandy, who released like washi tapes recently, and then I got some stickers from her. And then I got a shirt from a small shop that I will show you in just a second. But if you're interested in watching me unbox these, stick around. Uh, if you're interested in seeing me unbox orders from Emu's Designs, According to Allie, Simply Gilded, and Honey Press, check out the first part of this video, um, or the first part of this like two video series. Uh, but I'm just gonna go ahead and jump into it. I already took this out of the little mailer envelope that it came in because I wanted to get a look at it, but uh, this one is from Once Upon a Time Supply Co. Um, they're over on Instagram, and I found them on TikTok, actually. It was just, I was scrolling through my For You page, and I saw someone wearing this shirt, and I'm like, oh my god, I need that shirt. So I found them over on TikTok, and I ordered this shirt. It is on like a Comfort Colors cream colored t-shirt. And most of the stuff that they do is like Disney inspired stuff. I'm not even sure if this is like a Disney movie technically, but if you've ever seen the movie Aquamarine from the early 2000s, it's the one with like uh, the mermaid uh, who shows up in the pool during the storm in Florida. Anyway, um, this is the Mermaid Snacks t-shirt and it's just so cute. It has the Morton table salt, the like gummy worms, and then the Ben and Jerry's fish food ice cream. Um, I just think it's such a cute like nod to that movie, which was definitely a childhood favorite of mine. So I love this t-shirt. It is just like a short sleeve t-shirt um, and I'm excited to wear it. Very high quality and I think this is like screen printed so it's not even going to like come off. Um, like appealing like vinyl wood or like the heat transfer vinyl wood. So cute t-shirt, very excited about that. And now onto the planner stuff because that's probably what you're here for. I was looking to like upsize my social media planner now that I'm kind of doing social media um, a little bit more full time with like the sticker shop and stuff. So I was looking for a dashboard planner um, and I really wanted this one, this particular dashboard planner, the bring on today. Uh, it's undated which I think will be great because I'm kind of starting in the middle of a planner cycle. And this is the like bold and bright or yeah, I want to say that's what the colors are. Um, it's dashboard. It's really neutral, but it has like the really colorful dividers, although they sold out of it on the Happy Planner website. So I had to do some digging. I found this one on a website called Lovecrafts, which I had never heard of before. They're coming from, I want to say Delaware, um, but it's like a small like knitting and scrapbooking shop and they had this one in stock for a good price and I got a coupon off my first order. So I was like, I'm going to order it. It's an undated planner. I can use it at any point. And if I don't decide I want to use it now, I can use it later on because it's undated. So the dividers match that like color palette of that one sticker book that I use so much. Um, monthlies are pretty blank. We've got the weekly. It's the same as the planner that I'm currently using, just undated. So they're not numbered. I'll have to find a way to like number the spreads, but it's nice to have a little bit more space to spread out and also to decorate. You know me, that was kind of my ulterior motive here. Um, but I'll show you the dividers on this. So we've got some daisies. We've got one happy day in this mustard yellow color. The tabs are unmarked, so they had stickers in the beginning so you can like label them with the months. We've got get busy with the Dalmatian dot pattern and then the pink. We've got live life in full bloom. I think this was a 12 month planner. Um, okay, we've got the stripes right here. Get stuff done. More of those daisies, but in a lot of different colors. Hooray for today. The Dalmatian dots always sell me on, on different designs. Uh, live your dreams or dream, singular. Be kind, be a nice human. Bring on today. And then the inside of the cover is also that Dalmatian dot. It's like pink on pink. So I might even take this cover and like flip it inside out. I'm not sure yet, but this is the big dashboard planner that I got from Lovecraft. 
All the links to the websites will be down below in case you're interested in shopping from any of them, and I will try my best to include coupon codes if I can find them. Now we're into the sticker portion of this video. So this order is from Goldmine and Coco. It came in a little mailer envelope and then I took it out so that I could just like not have to deal with more packaging in this video. So it came with these little freebie cards, define your value. When you take risks, you learn that there will be times you succeed and there will be times when you fail and both are equally important. Ellen DeGeneres, little journaling cards. They're white on the back so you could write a message or something or you could take a tape runner and put these like into your planner and then i have a little postcard from gold mine and coco and i just ordered one set of stickers from them they were having a sale on their sticker dolls although they don't sell their sticker dolls like individually let me just open these up real fast what i was saying is they're not like a la carte you have to order either a bundle that has like a bunch of different sticker dolls in it or you order like five sheets of the same doll, which I was not exactly interested in like having like the same girl over and over and over again. So I found this bundle that was available in their sales section and I think it's called Love to Teach or something along those lines. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit so we can get a little bit more detail on the stickers. So they're all teaching themed and I just like the colors on their outfits and I think like in some ways like something like this where she's holding the books is also great for a student. I'm not going to be teaching again until January, so I have a little bit of a break, but I wanted to like get some more of these dolls while they were on sale. I love the paper texture on these. They've got this like clear back, so when you peel them up, it's a little startling. It's like you can see through the sheet after that. And they all come with names. So this one is Dr. Allen LB. I love the little outfit with the like bow tie. Just so pretty. And then we have Ms. Campbell LB with the jean jacket and the heels. We have Miss Renee LB. I'm not sure what the LB stands for. Maybe I'm losing my mind. It probably is obvious and I'm just not getting it. Uh, we get the little dress and the jean jacket again. We have Miss Smith LB with the floral dress and the apple. And then we have Mrs. Watson LB um, with the jeans and the little shirt and the notebooks it's so cute okay so five sheets came in this bundle i think i paid 35 dollars for them um total i think that included the shipping so they're a little bit on the pricier side but i really like the quality of these stickers and they're really cute on the pages the next order i have is from create with mandy and it came in one of these mailer envelopes because i got some of her new washi tape and everything is wrapped up all nicely so we've got on top like this hello beautiful thank you card that has my name on the back and like her codes for returning customers this is going to be the washi tape so it has the create with mandy logo on it and i got two rolls of the washi tape she released three new designs of it or three designs in the first place she hadn't had washi tape in her shop before this is like her first time doing that so this one is the like star pattern and it's hard to kind of tell when they're all overlapped over each other and then this one is the like plus signs although you can see from the cover what they look like so these are the stars like little sparkly stars and then these ones are the plus size it is 15 millimeter washi tape and it is 10 meters of that so pretty typical um with like regular washi tape the inside is not her branding it's probably where she got it from or like ordered from her vendor but very cute little washi tapes and then the stickers i got from her came in this separate packaging so freebie sticker on top that says summer vibes with the monstera leaf that is so pretty and then hand handmade and packed with love so cute um i feel like i keep saying everything is cute but everything is cute that's the problem here so i got a number of sheets from her mostly from her summer collection so this one is the desert landscapes too i like this longer expanse of the desert landscape um and she released desert landscapes three in this uh last release so i wanted to get this so i could or i wanted to get this one so i could pair it with the new one and make like a full desert spread so desert landscapes two and three i've already used desert landscapes one um, I already owned it, uh, but I was thinking I was going to order another one and then it was sold out. So I just settled on the two Desert Landscape sticker sheets. I love like how minimalistic these lines are, like just kind of tracing the um, 
like curves of the landscape. It's really pretty. And then we've got tiny florals, which is one that I've also had before, um, but I used most of them and I thought they were just such a nice little accent sticker. So tiny florals. We've got Mandy's shell collection, which is so pretty with all the different shells. I was um, thinking that the titles would be included on the stickers, like underneath the shells. So it would be like more of like a like a shell collection kind of thing, but it's just the shells that are cut out on the stickers, which isn't bad. And I feel like you could use an X-Acto knife to cut out the names of the shells if you really wanted to like include them with the, the stickers. And I'll probably end up doing that anyway. So Mandy's shell collection and then similar idea is the sea glass stories and they all have little names along with them, but the sea glass is the only part that's cut out. So these will be fun to kind of like layer over each other. These ones are on clear, these ones are all on paper. Um, so fun little sea glass. I love going to the beach and looking for sea glass over the summer. So I thought maybe a spread to that would be fun. And that's also why I got the summer boxes because they matched so well. So the summer boxes set is the two sheets. They come together. You can't buy them individually. One is the circles and the longer rectangles. And then this one is the checklists and the rectangle box stickers. And they're all in the color palette of like the sea glass or like the shell collection also matches in there. Um, like this kind of peachy tone matches. So I love when there's boxes that match your sticker sheets. That way you don't have to go hunting for the ones that'll match. And then the last piece of the order is this Make Waves Quotes sheet. So You, Me, and the Sea. This one is on the clear. It has this really nice like black lettering. It kind of looks like it was done with a marker. It's really pretty. Um, beach days, some little symbols. So you got a wave, a sun, and then a shell, make waves, and then aloha. So these are larger quote stickers. So there's not as many on here, but I think they make a really nice impact in a spread. Um, I was thinking like maybe I'd layer them over the sea glass or like even put them with the shells could be kind of fun. I'm not sure yet, but I'm excited to have all of these really summery options from Mandy. And then the last order that I got is this one from Red Lyrics. Um, so I've never ordered from her before and she's over on Etsy. I've seen a few people use her stickers and she does like sticker dolls and I've been really into those Goldmine and Coco dolls recently. They're just a little bit pricey and these ones were on sale. They were 40% off. So I'm like, I'll try out some different varieties of sticker dolls. And I know this is like a weird thing to say about stickers, but these smell really, really good. Um, there's this card on top that has my name hand lettered on it. Like this is stunning lettering. Um, love this little journaling card. And then there's also a calendar freebie in here. So this is the freebie that came with my order for June. This would be nice if you're like doing bullet journaling. You could like put this in your like monthly or something like that. But these leaves match the like design on that. And I ordered like 17 sheets of these sticker dolls because they were so cheap, like 40% off and they're normally like $4 or something like that. So I ordered a lot of them. Um, and the thing I like about these is that they're not all like repeats of each other. With the Goldmine and Cocoa ones, you get um, like each doll twice and then they're mirrored. But these, you only get one of each, um, each girl. So we've got shades of green. I love like the A-line skirt kind of aesthetic. So these are the shades of green dolls that I picked out. And you have an option on their website of picking like uh, the lighter skin or the darker skin, depending on like how you would like your stickers to look. If you'd like them to look like you or if you want to like diversify a little bit. I ordered a combination of the two. Um, so I ordered a lot that were ones that kind of reminded me of myself, but I also ordered some like that were just like people that don't look like me. Um, so we've got shades of green. We've got this one that is black and white fashion. So it's little black and white outfits on this one. Very businessy. We've got girls in green. I feel like I feel, was like really feeling green when I was shopping. But this girl is just so summery to me with like the headband and the little feathery purse. It's just so cute. And then we've got coffee girls. I liked them because they all had the little hunter rain boots on and I thought that would be fun for like a rainy day with the little vest. And this one's a little bit more Christmassy, I would say. We've got the curvy girls, number 10 brown skin. I was expecting these ones to be a little bit like darker skinned um, for like the, the darker skin tone, but they're really cute like with all the little outfits. I like this red one again like very holiday holiday-y I thought these could be fun for like when I'm going on like I don't know like occasions like if I'm going on like a date night like I like the little dresses 
So these are fun for like a daily planner or like even a full planner spread. We've got Fashion Girls 11. So there's a lot of different options to pick from. She had like 400 different sticker sheets. Like she's been at this for a while, but Fashion Girls 11. We've got Girls in Coat number six. I thought this would be good for like fall. I like the yellow coat with like the purple lining on it. Just very nice neutral colors that could go with any different spread that I was like making. Here we have Fashionistas number 12 brown skin. I like this little two-piece outfit or this one with the sheer layering. I thought that was really cute that she's like playing around with different textures. We've got Fashion Girls 54. This one felt a little bit more nautical to me with like the stripes and then the like sailor style, style skirt there, um, the striped bag. Very fun for summer. We've got summer dresses, which I was, again, intending for like summer, uh, the embroidery, and that's really pretty with all the stripes. I just think these are gorgeous. She's taking a lot of care to like draw these like faces and bodies. They're just really pretty. Then we have Fashion Girls 3. And I mainly got this for this one with the polka dot purse and like the kind of Parisian inspired outfit. I think it's cute, like very great for like a traveling spread. We've got Coffee Girls, number four, brown skin. Love the little peplum polka dot shirt. I don't really drink coffee, but I think there's just something so like chic about like the, the sticker dolls drinking coffee. This one, Fashion Girls 25. I love the pink tones and this is probably my favorite outfit on this one with the polka dot shirt and the pink suit. It is so cute. We've got Fashion Girls 42. So more like kind of fall outfits. I would say this is more summery, but just some cute like stickers. Here's a more seasonal one. I thought these would be nice for like holiday season. So curvy Christmas, number two, brown skin. Um, look at the little garland of the stars. That's so pretty. And then she's holding the wreath and she's got the floral. I just wanted some seasonal stuff that I could like work into like different points in the year. We've got girls in floral. So these are all like floral outfits. I love this little purse with like the, the faux floral like appliques on it. We've got girls in floral number two. Oh, this was girls in floral number three. I didn't get girls in floral number one, I guess. Um, but this is the last one that I got. I got so many from this shop, but they're all so pretty and I can't wait to like work these into like my daily planner. Um, Cause I just think they add like a nice little touch, but that's all I've got from Red Lyrics and it's quite a few sticker sheets. And I think they're gonna need to take up their own Simply Gilded album at this point. But that's all of the orders that I have for this video. And here's part two of my small shop haul. And I think that's gonna be the end of it. Um, whenever that Joanne's order gets in, it'll get in, but I'll figure that out later. But a lot of fun small shops, everything is linked down below. So we have Once Upon a Time, Supply Co. We have Lovecraft, that's just a happy planner that I ordered off of their site, but they have some other fun crafting materials, Gold Mine and Coco, Red Lyrics, and then Create with Mandy. Let me know down in the comments which one you think I should be using first of all of these sticker sheets. I am very much in love with like this particular design of sticker doll. Um, although there's so many sticker dolls to choose from in this order. And then with the crate with Mandy, I'm like leaning towards the sea glass, but I'm just not sure if I want to use it just yet. So we'll see what happens with that, but let me know what you're thinking. Um, I'll also try to include coupon codes if I have them down below, but I don't know if I have any for any of these except for Create with Mandy, um, who I know M is on her rep team. So that's M10 for 10% off at Create with Mandy. Everything is down below and there you have it. If you like this video, hit that like button down below. You can also subscribe to my channel for more fun planner related content and follow me over on Instagram at Caitlin Plans, where I share after the pen photos as well as photos of spreads that did not get videos. Thanks for watching and happy planning.